Hi there, this is Jonathan Victor, and I'm making this recording for my friend Judy. Judy is a talented, innovative, and inspiring health educator, among other things. Now, Judy, you might appreciate the irony of this. Sorry that I'm making this recording with a bit of a stuffy nose. Um, Judy, you had asked me for three things to help you find some software that students could use to keep track of their nutrition and their fitness. You'd asked me to help you find any other online resources related to uh, teaching health class that might be useful. And you asked me to see if I could help you grow your personal learning network. In other words, maybe to get some tips um, and some uh, networking with other health teachers uh, who might have some good ideas about how to find the best possible health resources out there. So here's what I've come up so far. All of this information I'm going to share the links for either directly in the comments section of this YouTube video or perhaps I'll put a link to my blog and we can share it that way. Alright, so first category, these are some simple apps um, on the web that students could use. Here we have a children's healthy eating calculator. You see it thinks about um, their age, weight, height, gender, activity level, and uh, some different types of food intake. And I haven't seen what happens yet if you hit calculate, but I'm thinking you could take a look at all the things I'm sharing and perhaps the top three or four we could investigate in greater detail. Here's another one, a fitness calculator that takes into account your nutritional needs. A nutrition calculator, I believe you use this menu to enter the foods you're eating, and I think you learn some things about that. And um, a daily needs calculator right over here. So that's the first category. The second category, um, still nutrition and fitness apps. This is a video from CNET, the technology um, website. They reviewed three different mobile phone apps that might be useful. Um, I'm not sure for 7th and 8th graders, it might be collecting too much information about them, but we could look into it. The advantage is, I imagine, it's a little bit glossier and more visually appealing. So that's the... Now you have a con and a pro for that. And another similar one, Foodurama for the iPhone. In that same basic category of slightly glossier apps, we have some apps from the Google Chrome Web Store. You can get these for free if you have the Chrome Web Browser, but you can also follow these links and just access them from just about any other web browser also. This one's the most popular. They call it My Net Diary. It has 9,000 users. And you can read here about how it <coughs> pardon me, keeps track of food and gives some exercise tips. Some people online were saying good things about Daily, <coughs> pardon me, Daily Burn. There's My Eat Box, Virtua Gym, which gives some specific ideas about what kinds of exercise you can be doing, and it also keeps track of nutrition, I believe. Here are some different exercises. Along those lines, Gain Fitness and Diet Diary. So those are all the nutrition and uh, fitness software pieces that I found. I was just Googling nutrition and fitness, and if you like anything, we can look into it more. Along the lines of other useful resources on the web, this is from the USDA, as you can see from the URL right here, and um, it's an online textbook related to health. Students can quiz themselves as they go. There are some pictures. Might be useful, might be worth checking out. Other resources from the USDA, we have this Community Nutrition Action Kit and a bunch of resources for educators. And that brings us to our last thing, which is seeing if any of the other health educators who might be watching this have tips that they might offer, or maybe they'd be willing to collaborate with Judy in the future um, as we work together to find the best possible health curriculum out there, especially if you work with 7th or 8th graders. Please let us know. All right. So I'm Jonathan Victor, and I hope that helps.